Well, it was supposed to be a fun celebration and witnesses say it turned to chaos. Tonight, investigators are looking for who shot teenagers during a birthday party at a local college. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Genevieve Curtis. Police tell us shortly after midnight, two teenagers were shot at Clinton College in Rock Hill, South Carolina. Deshaun Brown is live at the college tonight. Deshaun, school officials are telling you that this party was not thrown by them. Genevieve, they are telling us that they actually rented out the gym for that birthday party. They also say that none of the people involved had any ties to this college. Just imagine how deer is coming to you when you're about to hit your car. That's how those kids are running to the street. Cran Neely says he witnessed the trauma for himself. Neely was driving by Clinton College overnight when teenagers flooded the street. How many kids? Oh man, hundreds of kids, hundreds and hundreds of kids because I went around the building. A few moments later, Neely says he learned why they were running. I said, what y'all running for? What happened? And they said, man, they shoot and they shoot. And then, you know, all of them kept saying it and they kept running while they were saying this. Investigators tell us two teens were shot last night, both of whom should recover. It happened during a birthday party on campus in the Clinton College gym. In a statement, the college says the gym was rented out by an outside group with no ties to the college, then added none of its students nor staff were hurt. I knew they weren't college kids, even though it was on a college camp. I could tell it was, it was a high school, and it, it, was, it was fear. You could, see, you could see the fear. Neely says he never saw the teenagers who were shot, but learned many of their peers had. You could tell they were traumatized because that, that, that shouldn't happen. It was just craziness, like something from a movie. That's how I look. And I have also spoken with investigators tonight who told me they are still trying to track down the shooter. They say that it got very chaotic overnight and it's likely a lot of people scrambled from this scene, but they are still looking to speak with more witnesses who might have seen what happened. Back to you, Genevieve. All right, Deshaun, hopefully they are able to find the shooters in this case.